Hello YouTube, this is Bash bringing you here for week three. Uh, we're just going to go over the team builder before the match. And my opponent has a very terrifying team. We're playing against Fierce Flamethrower. Um, they don't have a team name at the moment that I know of, so um, yeah, but we're playing against them this week. Gonna say, worst matchup of the season. Uh, and in the top right should be coming up the matchup right now. Uh, the team, their team consists of Zygarde, 50, Terra, Megalopony, Chiyu, Screamtail, Corviknight, Overquill, Rillaboom, Dondozo, Terra, Electric, Hisuian, and Morgrim. My team of course consists of, actually, not even of course, because we made transactions between week 2 and week 3, which probably should, probably might know of already because I mentioned them in my week 2 video, but in case you haven't, uh, I'll go over them in a second. But our team consists of Iron Valiant, Palafin, Terra Diggers beat Uxi, Terra Superior, Kilowatchel, Pelipper, Karkul, Dragalgy, Fortress, and Absol, where we dropped Hisuian Quillfish and Ticketon for Dragalgy, Fortress, Absol to help more with the um, momentum as well as the fact that Hazard Control was a big one, was like a big one with that. And Dragalgy gives me a, uh, Dragalgy I think gives me a lot more than what Hisuian Quillfish gave me for my team. So, and we also got a Pursuit Trapper, which is really nice in Absol. So, yeah. Um, yeah, this matchup is awful for me. Like, straight up awful. I have to bring some tech. I have to bring a lot of, like, I feel like I had to bring a lot of weird, really weird sets in order to try to deal with this team because the combination of Screamtail, Don Dozo, uh, makes it really, just those two alone are very difficult for my team. Plus, you add in Corviknight to deal with, uh, Dragalgy. So we got those three. Those three. So annoying. But then on top of that, you got uh, things that like tr that are really good at pressuring my team. Like uh, Zygarde 50, right? Chi Yu, one of the best breakers in the game. So, and it's just going to be, I think it's going to be really difficult. The My biggest worry is the three, the core of three of Screamtail, Corviknight, and Wishy, uh, Don Dozo I'm at. Because... First off, Dondo's one of the best, uh, one of the best Palafin answers. Uh, Corviknight, the best, probably Dragalgy, uh, answer, right? Um, and it's also a really good Iron Valiant, uh, answer. And then Spidef Screamtail is really annoying for this matchup. So, uh, because it helps, it kind of walls a lot of, like, my mods that, like, I would really, that would actually put in the work if it wasn't for there, like, something like Kilowatchel, right? Um... It could be really. It also is really annoying against Iron Valiant, so that's something to keep in mind. And then the, I don't really switch in that well into Chiyu, if um, depending on what he decides to click, because although they don't really, the fire type moves aren't that amazing against me. My dark resists aren't like the the best at the moment uh, with Iron Valiant and Absol. So Dark Pulse feels like it's a pretty spammable move against my team. So that's something to keep in mind at least, but. Yeah, and then of course Zygarde Terra is like literally busted. I, I used it before in Crash, with uh, where I was only allowed to Terra normal, and it was like the kill kill leader of that season. I'm pretty sure. Yeah, um, that thing's stupid, by the way. So not excited about this matchup, but we're gonna have to go with it. We brought some tech to try to hopefully get past it. Um, oh yeah, Don Dozo's was one of the best Diggers B answers too. And I could have bought Terra to Electric Diggers B to maybe try to break through that core, but then the Zygarde was just so annoying with it. So I thought it was better not to just bring Diggers B. But um, looking into this, looking into this matchup, though, I expect the, uh, I expect Screamtail, Corviknight, Don Dozo 100% to come. And then the last three spots I think are up for grabs. I think Zygarde 50 will probably will most likely come for four for the, the fourth mon. And then I think Chi Yu will probably come. At the fifth slot, and then the sixth slot, I think it could go up to a couple different things. I think Rillaboom is a good, is a nice way, a uh, nice mod to bring against me. But then again, um, there's a lot of things that kind of dissuade it, such as for, uh, Fortress, right? Uh, Kilowatchel kind of thing. So I think that might be a nice way to deal with it. But they could bring it in case because Rillaboom is always nice to have for uh, Palafin as well. And then. Mm -hmm. Let's see Megalopony. I have one of the better Megalopony answers in Uxie too, so not sure about that one. Suing Electrode needs to be Terra if it wants to, if it wants to be able to come in this game because Kilowatch was able to wall it otherwise. And could see Overquill. Uh, a lot of people bring T-Spikes against me. I don't think they will anymore with me having Dragalge and Fortress. 
now on the team, but you never know. But Overquill is a possibility as well. And then I don't see Morgrim coming. And that's, yeah, I cover everything in the team. So I, I think what I think they bring is the Corviknight, Screamtail, Don Dozo, Zygarde, Chi Yu, and then the spot I think will be up for grabs between Megalopony, Rillaboom, really Boomer, Overquill. I don't think. I don't think History and Electro should come out, um, because I think Terra Zagger is a lot better against my team, but it is what it is. But here's the team we're going to. We're going to lead off straight up with our first pick, right? Iron Valley, Expert Barrel, Calm Mind, Moonblast, Thunderbolt, Vacuum Wave. I might change up the set, but right bef a little bit before to like Pixie Plate to try to hit Screamtail harder, but I thought it would be really good for Calm Mind, uh, Vacuum Wave, because Vacuum is really good for the specifically the Chi Yu and the Megalopony. And, uh, those hit, that hits are really hard. Uh, that's another reason I could see really Boom coming because really Boom is a good answer to like check this if I get like out of hand with booster energy. But I think this could be a really good set. Thunderbolt is really nice for Corviknight and Don Dozo. Moonblast is really good against everything else. Um, especially since I, uh, but um, the reason, yeah, for Vacuum Wave, I expect Scarf Chiyu um, to come because I don't see it really being as viable without it, to be honest. Um, because then, like, I've been bringing, like, Scarf Diggers B, I brought Scarf Diggers B, which isn't that bad of a matchup here, I guess, and then, like, um, to outspeed Iron Valiant without the booster, uh, to outspeed, like, things like the Superior and Kilowatchel, I think that's why they'll bring Scarf, but I don't know. Um, they could bring, like, a Jet Pack, because I've seen them run that before, but that's something to keep in mind. I might change this to Pixie Plate, not sure. I went with Expert Belt to get the extra damage out on Corviknight and the Megalopony and Chiyu. Those were the three I wanted the Expert Belt for. I guess Don Dozo too helps as well, but yeah. I think this thing could be really good. Um, the best way, the best Pokemon that checks this is the Screamtail, which unfortunately is so annoying, but there's not much I can really do about it. Um, I'm gonna have to try to weaken it down with other mods on my team. So that's something to keep in mind. Next, we are going to go with Uxie here. I'm gonna skip over Superior for a second because I wanna go over uh, why, um, why I'm running this set. Um, U-Turn, Encore, Psychic Noise, Trick Room. This is to help against Zygarde, but it also is really good utility for something that's coming up. I also think that like, uh, with the fact that they have Megalopony, right? Chiyu, Scarf Chiyu probably, uh, Dragon Dance, Possibly Dragon Dance Zygarde, stuff like that. I feel like Trick Room would be really nice in this matchup um, for something like, say, like Dragology to go off. We'll see in a second. But the real reason that I'm running Trick Room is because of another mod I'll show in a second. But U Turn, Encore, Psych Noise, Trick Room, Rocky Helmet. Rocky Helmet is for the Megalop and you get chipper damage off of it. It's good for Rillaboom too. But yeah, this is mainly to help with um, Annoy Zygarde with the setup opportunities. So. If I get Encore into something like a Dragon Dance or like Coil, I could like make the appropriate switch into the next Pokemon and be able to deal with it. Um, and Psychic Noise prevents it from resting up or getting Leftovers Recovery, since I've seen them run the rest a lot, so that's something to keep in mind. Um, if they're like a Toxic Zygarde, I think I actually prefer that so much more in this match than the, um, like a Dragon Dance or a Coil set. So um, I expect Terra Water Zygarde, by the way, too, um, or Terra Grass, uh, specifically because... Um, I think they'll try to help that with Palafin or, uh, or Terra Grass for Superior as well. So that's something to keep in mind. But the reason why I'm running Uxie with Trick Room is because of this monster right here. We got Room Service Superior. Uh, this is uh, going to be our 100% our wing con. Uh, it looks really good this game. Leaf Storm, Terror Blast, Fire, Taunt, and Synthesis. Taunt is there literally for Screamtail because um, if, if I taunt the Screamtail, Screamtail can't do much to me at all. And I can just Synthesis back up. Uh, Leaf Storm um, and Terra. I want Terra Boss Fire. I was debating between a bunch of different Terras. I felt like Fire was the best to, but first off, make sure that Choice Spin, Riddle Boom, Brassy Fire doesn't do much to me. Um, to hit Corviknight as hard as possible. And to resist this, um, the Fire type moves from Chi Yu. I think it was probably the best cover, the best Mon, right? Um, it also helps against the uh, Suning Electro, too. Um, especially if it's like a Terra Ice, like assuming Electro, which I think it has to be if it comes in this match. Um, maybe Terra Rock or something like that instead. But um, either way, I think it's uh, fine. And then um, 
the Pokemon that, the Pokemon that like Don Del is it right doesn't want to switch into Terra Class Fire, um, and I can deal with it really easy with the Leaf Storm. So I think this is a really good set for this game. Um, this is my wing con. I'm gonna try to get Uxi to get the trick uh, the to Trick Room, and then pivot around until we get the last turn of uh, Trick Room. Where I'm gonna get Superior in on the last turn, get the Room Service off, so I'm at plus one speed because I'm contrary. Room Service drops the speed, but in con with contrary, it boosts the speed by plus one. I will outspeed everything on their team minus the Choice Scarf, Asuna, Electrode, and I should be able to put in a lot of work that way. Um, I thought Synthesis was also best because that way, in case they try to fake out Shuffle with me, uh, with Megalopony, I could try to like Synthesis up on something, um, worst case scenario. Um, yeah, but I think this does really well. I love uh, Choice Scarf, Chiyu, Hits, if I'm Terrifier, like I do. Um, but um, the one thing I want to make sure is be careful about the Zygarde 50, uh, specifically if it's... If I'm terrored because I believe I want to get like a leaf storm or two off before I uh, before I terror fire, um, hopefully. So I'm expecting to maybe pivot Corviknight hard on here or Screamtail, and I'm gonna leaf storm. So I'll leaf storm once on it, and then either uh, if Screamtail I taunt, if it's Corviknight I might go for, I might tear and then leaf storm again, and that should be all right. I will have there'll probably be pressure. I'll be down to four PP of leaf storm, but that should be enough because Terror Blast and leaf storm should be able to clean up the rest of the game. Hopefully, um, so that's kind of the idea there. But yeah, I hope this uh, superior puts in the work. Um, literally, my wing con this game. So yeah, next Pokemon is Kalawatro making its debut this week. Uh, U turn Thunderbolt, Hurricane, Air Slash, Wise Glasses. Their only Stealth Rocker is Screamtail, so I felt like it was probably a safe bet that um, they're not gonna, they're probably not going to want to be rocks. I feel like either like a really big utility set. Um, I feel like it doesn't have like the move slots to be able to run. Uh, stealth rocks on this team unless you really really want rocks against my team which i don't know if it's really absolutely necessary against my team but that is with it um but this thing it hits his team extremely hard except for screamtail screamtail is the only pokemon that does not hit hard this actually uh can two shot um zygarde depending on the set um with hurricane with the wise boss is modest um which is really nice um I actually don't even outspeed Screamtail if he's like really fast Screamtail. I'm running at enough speed to outspeed Chiyu because I wanted the extra, uh, I wanted the modest nature by the way, but I also wanted to be able to take a hit or two from Rillaboom if need be. I guess like a grassy guy kind of thing. Um, and Air Slash I have just in case of, um, I don't want to risk the Hurricane. So that's something to keep in mind. I am Volt Absorb. Um, so if the Hissuni Electric comes and it's not Terra Ice or Rock, this is pretty easy. This is a pretty nice switch in. I also have like uh, Geography in the back of C that is a pretty nice switch in as well. But I think this mod is really good. U-turn is nice to pivot out there. Um, yeah, and it's really nice to stop uh, Volt's uh, Volt, uh, Electric coverage against me from like oh, Hissuni Electric from Volt switching all over. Um, this is a really good mod. I want to run competitive. But I just couldn't bring myself to do it because Hisuian Electric could be really annoying um, if I don't run this. So, depending on the set. So, I decided to go with it. Um, yeah, uh, I need the Screamtail to be weakened. If it's not Spideff, then this will be like not that bad of a play. Um, but if it is Spideff, um, I don't really do much to it. I think I do like max like 36%-ish or 36-40%. So, I'm going to need to be able to pivot around. And this is partly why I'm going to have the next one you'll see. Um, this Palafin here, uh, I went through many different sets. I was originally AV uh, in this matchup because uh, to help I take a hit from Chiyu, but I decided to go with Mystic Water. I wanted the extra damage against the Screamtail. So I got Jet Punch, Wave Crash, Flip Turn, Grass Knot. I don't hit Rillaboom really with this set, but Wave Crash does a lot still, uh, depending on the set. And I don't think I don't know if I expect Really Boom to be really, really bulky, but if I flip, I can always if I always expect Really Boom to come in, I just flip turn out, um, and get into like something like Kilowattro here, uh, that can put in the pressure or my next or my next Mondragogy. But yeah, this is the set I'm running with. Uh, Grass Knot is enough to three shot, uh, Spideff, Dondosa with leftovers. Um, that's kind of the adjustment there. The 96 in special attack and the minus speed nature, which by the way. Running minus speed nature, I feel like I didn't really need the speed uh, in this match. I'd rather have like the bulk and the special attack coverage, so I went brave. Um, also, it could be really cool in the trick room option, but um, I feel like I didn't really need because Jet Punch is a lot better here. I wasn't going to outspeed. I didn't want to outspeed. I wasn't going to probably outspeed Zygarde anyway, so I felt like I was just. I'd rather just go with like um, to be able to hit as hard as possible, but still have like a good amount of bulk as well. Um, 
So I felt like this was the best case scenario of what I wanted to go with. Uh, let's see. Yeah. I thought it was the best we could go with. Grass not really good. I don't really hit Hasuni Electro, but Hasuni Electro does not want to switch into me too because Wave Crash is going to like two shot it. Um, I believe Rillaboom, I think like after a little chip damage, it could get two shot depending on the set with Wave Crash because it hits like a truck, Mystic Water, Wave Crash. Um, this is really good also for Chiyu. I could take a hit from Chiyu as long as it's not Specs. Um, can take a hit from Megalopony and. If he goes Zygarde, uh, if he's Terra Water Zygarde, Grass Knot does about half, depending on the set, which is really nice. And finally, um, if they go Terra Grass on Zygarde, pr first of all, props to them, but I think I have uh, enough responses with like Kilowatchel, uh, Superior, and Dragalge if they do that. Um, and I don't think they should go Terra Grass because I have like a, uh, I think I have ways in the back to be able to handle it as well. But yeah, this is the set I'm going with. Oh, especially since I could have be Ice Punch straight up on Palafin, I almost was, but I wanted the flip term to be able to keep up momentum to try to get superior in the last uh turn of trick room so something to keep in mind yeah uh and then last but not least we got this dragology set this is another set i'm really considering like switching over a lot i was literally just sludge bomb earlier and now i'm sludge wave um, i might change thunder to something else i may change the investment but really weird set um this is has two different roles in this game well three i guess um first of all to be momentum user Second is to be able to chew a be able to switch into really boom more consistently. Um, even though I do have a fortress in the back, I also wanted a way to check Chi Yu, which is why I have a salt vest as well. Um, I don't take specs that amazingly well. I just don't think specs is going to come to be honest. Um, it allows Iron Valley a free setup move, which is going to be really clutch. I think it has to be Scar for like some weird eject button set, but that's really I think this is going to be really clutch. Thunder. Very interesting. Wanted it. I went for it for Coronite because it's the best way I could hit it. Um, thought about making a Dragon Tail. Might consider it. Uh, might consider switching it. But yeah, this is the set we're going with. Uh, I'll let you know if I change it before the match. Um, yeah, so that's the team we're going with. Uh, I'll cut to the match. Hello, and we're back for the game. Um, yeah, so we are playing Fierce Length Thrower, as I mentioned in Team Builder. Brought no Dozo? That's crazy. And he bought Terra Poison, Zygarde. Milopony. Zygarde. Poison. Um, Rillaboom. Scream Tail. Corv. I'm just gonna leave. Often. Corv and Chi Yu. So crazy team they brought. No Dozo, so um, that's unfortunate. Um, well, not unfortunate, but I could have brought. Um, I definitely could have brought uh, Diggersby then. Diggersby would have gone crazy. Um, Digg so Corviknight might be Fizz Duff, to be honest. And I'm assuming then that if that's the case. Um, superior is his way to. Yeah, I'm going straight into Uxie here. Um, so Zygarde is his way to try to deal with Superior. Something to really note here. I'm gonna go straight into Uxie though. Uxie's always a play against Mega Lobbinny. I want to get this thing off. Um, Terra. Yeah, so it's just Terra Zygarde. They didn't bring a Suit Electrode. Oh man. Well, a bulk up set could have gone crazy too. Well. That's what happens uh, when you have a dozo, forces a lot of prep. Um, yeah, so Lee Megalopony and. Huh. I'll figure out a way to. Superior so looks crazy though. I just need to be able to play around the side guard really well. What do they go for? Return? Bro! That's so. That sucks so much. Okay. Well, that really bad. Well, how much? He's adamant. 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 Well, that sucks. Um, I guess I'll just go into Sludge Villa on the predicted U-turn. Yeah. 
Um, that crit sucks already off the bat, because now I'm gonna go, uh, not really a switch in. Well, it is what it is, we'll have to play around it. Um, so, we're going to drag Algae here. I'm expecting either the Lop, the Zy I was expecting Zyger to come out here. So, what I could do, it's Terra Poison. Could flip turn out. I, they could go Corvi, I think they go Corvi or Zygarde here. I don't think they go, yep, they go Zygarde, okay. So, what's my best play here? Could Dragon Pulse get damage off, and then, um, Rillaboom comes kind of quite an issue. Flip turn out. Do I, how much do I take from a Zygarde hit? I don't think I, I think I take one. Yeah. I don't know if flip turn in case he goes for the D-Dance, I think. He probably subs. Terra Poison. Thousand Arrows to 62%. Max attack. Okay. I'm gonna go straight into Palfin and just Wave Crash, I think. To Rillaboom. He's Rocky Helmet. Interesting. Rocky Helmet. That probably means he's defensive. Oh, I wish I brought Ice Punch. Well, it is what it is. Because he's, he's. We've crushed it 31%. Yeah, he's definitely Fizz Def as heck. Yeah, Fizz Def. Okay, let's slow down. Think about the plays. Um, I could go to Kilowatcha here, but I feel like. Going to Dragao just fine here too. You guys for your turn. This is the worst deal in the world. I am taking like chip damage though with Palafin, which kind of sucks. Mm. That's for your turn. I'm just gonna flip turn again. If he kills me, whatever. Um, shows no item though. Very interesting. I'm gonna go back into Palafin here, and I'm just gonna flip turn out into Kilowatchel. Because Kilowatchel now could put in the work. Um, yeah, okay. Let's get into Kilowatchel here. And I am going to. You turn out, or should I? Hmm. Perky might be nice here, to be honest. Uh, until I don't expect the. I'm sure I'm just gonna U-turn. Expecting the scream tail. Yep, yeah, which comes out. Does seven percent. Oh, so he's fizz def. Oh, right. fizz def probably or mixed. He's probably mixed. Okay. I kind of want to go for a trick room here. I kind of want to go trick room. I'm going to on court first. He goes for rocks. Interesting. So he does have rocks. Did he show item? He did not. I think I, the way I need to do this is I need to make sure. The Palfin gets in on the third turn. Yeah, 
Okay, awesome, and I get the U-turn out. And let's see what they go into. Um, the thing is, so, what do I expect to come in? Rillaboom, maybe? <sighs> this is really tough. How much does Rillaboom do if he's, since he's fist deaf, he's... It's Corviknight. Interesting. Hello, Watchel. I'm just gonna U-turn out. This might work out perfectly because I U-turn out on the screen tail and go for the flip turn and just surf on the last turn. How much does Palfin Hero do to Tail? And Sir could just put in the work here because. This is going to be really that tough, though. He's not choice banned. He's U-turn. Scream tail. And I think I go straight out to Palfin and flip turn out. And this should work out perfectly. So that 43. I need to pop this early. He's Terra Poison, Zygarde. Perfect. And I get Grassy Terrain up. Okay. So, I don't know if I want to Terra yet, because did it show any damage on Zygarde? I did not yet. He showed to be how much attack again earlier? 1000 arrows. 61%. So he's probably... Yeah. Okay. Can I have some bulk? But... Uh, if we could get... Uh... I think I Leaf Storm here. I don't think I Terra yet. Give me the boost. Bro, stop critting me, bro. Oh my god, this is so frustrating. <laughs> uh... I'm just gonna Leaf Storm run off chance it doesn't kill. Yeah. Um, I'm gonna synthesis on the switch out. That's so frustrating that that's doing that. Okay, great. That's perfect. And I get another Leaf Storm off. Let's go. Been waiting on bringing up. Okay, so I get another kill here. So our plus four. Grassy Terrain is gonna be gone. Okay, we're in a pretty good position here. We go Scream Tail, I taunt, and then Leaf Storm again. I hope he brings in Scream Tail, actually. If, he ta if I taunt it, it's gonna be really good. Megalophony, I need to stay out of range of Megalophony fake out uh so that means i need to stay out of 32 31 percent 30 i want to keep out of 32 percent range hmm i think i taunt it's getting to first and then leaf storm again or i synthesis then leaf storm because then I think I just win at that point. Because Zygarde already is Terra Poison.
If I get the plus six. Oh, he does go to you. Okay. Chris does enough. I think I just Terra and Leaf Storm. And hopefully he chokes. Because at this point, although Palfin looks crazy now, but at this point, we are not looking too hot here. Although, oh yeah, especially since Zygarde's still here. I think I do Terra and Leaf Storm. And he gets the kill. Okay. That. U turn crit came in huge earlier then. Did Dark Wolf ever kill without? That's. Dude, those crits were so huge. I was so sad that didn't work. Okay. Um. What's my play here? I'm not looking too hot right now. I need this Zygarde to go. But there's not much I could do really about it. And I would have lived that. To, I probably would have lived that unless it was specs. If it's specs, then it's a different story. But if it's scarf. Or no boosting item, I would have lived if you didn't get the crit. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go into. That sucks. Okay. <sighs> yeah, let's go to you. How much does Zygarde do to me? Oh, the arrows. Thank you. Okay. He's definitely so he's scarf. But pulse. And if I get up another one. Well, should not do much, and I can at least put it, or I just, or do I just click Thunderbolt here, predicting the switch out? I think I want the second command, because Megalopony, oh, uh, bro. Crits, bro. I would have been at a higher health too. Okay. I'm just gonna thunderbolt this. This shit. It's Rakan. Yep. I. Right. Yep. Okay. Yeah, I think this is game. To be honest, uh, I should have known it coming into this game that this was. I need some hacks or something to go my way because I don't think I'm getting out of this. Maybe if I get Trick Room up, I could win. But I don't think I could break the Scream Tail enough that Megalopony Fake Out wouldn't kill me. Let's hack this off. It's not enough. Yeah. Man, those crits were rough. Okay. Well, it's Pokemon. Um. Yeah, at this point, they just click return. Let's get Air Slash. Maybe the Underspeed. There's no way, though. I'm only at speeding to you. Man, mm. let's 
to have Scarf? I don't think so, though. Yeah. I should have T-bolted on the switch. But I was thinking about Zygarde. I didn't have much to do with it. <sighs> that was definitely the play, though. Was that plus two? It wasn't even Spadaf. Yeah. That's crazy. So if I was plus one, then about half, yeah. That was the play. Man, okay. That is what it is. But yeah, I think Fierce Playthrough is going to pick this up. Um, they're probably predicting if I'm Scarf or not because I stayed in there. And I am going to go for a Hurricane Confusion here. And hopefully. He is faster than me. Crazy. He's Wish. I'm just gonna fire off another Hurricane. He's Wish. He's Psychic Noise. Okay. I'm gonna set up another Trick Room because I outspeed everything. But I don't think. I think. I don't think. I think Lopini is able to stall out. Yeah. Okay. No way this takes out screen time. <laughs> no way psychic moves take takes out screen time. I'm just gonna U turn. Yeah. Oh it does. Well GG. Well this <laughs> <laughs> yeah, there's not much I could do. I I already had a terrible matchup to begin with. Uh, that's crazy that that. Oh my god! If I didn't get crit with the Rillaboom earlier on the on the Superior, I would have won the game because I would have been out. I should have been out of range, a hundred percent of the time. Jeez, man. Maybe I should have teared first. That probably was the play, but I didn't want to. I didn't want Zyger to come in. There's not much I could do. Oh my god! Well, first live combat I'm back, and <laughs> uh, yeah. Well, it almost worked. Maybe if I was a different Terra type. I don't know. Cause if he was since he was Scarf. And I could literally check what kind of, if he was probably modest or timid here. Leaf Storm. How much Dark Pulse do to Iron Valiant? Dark Pulse did how much? 28%. He was modest. Okay. Maybe it wasn't as bad a deal because that Dark Pulse into Leaf Storm would have taken me out probably. Oh, not Dark Pulse. Dark Pulse into Fake Out because if you check the damage here. Oh, I can see this. Let me see this. Um, Dark Pulse did 70%, 82% if he's modest Scarf, which I'm guessing he is based on the cap. Is, um, there's no way he could have done that much with Iron against Iron Valiant if it was timid, I think, right? But 20... Actually? Yeah, wait. Wait, wait. Yeah, yeah. Okay, so he was definitely modest. Um... So, if I wasn't crit, I would have taken down Chiyu. Megalopity would have probably came in, faked me out. <sighs> I would have played the well, game well. Maybe I should have synthesized again in Rillaboom. 
If I synthesis again on Rillaboom, or I, I Terra into... I should have Terra the first time, I think. I was just nervous about the Zygarde. Man. I don't know. There wasn't much I think I could do with that point. The crit on... I wish I... I didn't want to pull the trigger that early on Superior. Maybe I should have gotten Rocks up. If I got Rocks up, I think that was game. Maybe if I got brought Rocks on something. Maybe I should have brought it on... Ooxie. I guess. Yeah. That was probably it. Yeah, well... GG to Fierce Flame. Uh, they brought the right sets. Uh, and... They got the right i want to say hack but uh i don't know if the like it definitely wouldn't matter in terms of like killing the like being fine with the chi yu i would have definitely been fine because the crit on with the rule of boom he would have gone i don't think he would have gone i don't think he would have gone um yeah, I would have been... Wait, okay, I wasn't terrified yet. Okay. Yeah, I would have been about half. Grassy Terrain is up. So I would have been able to get back a little bit more health. And... So I would have been over half. If that's the case. And to be honest... Hmm. I mean, they probably would have played differently with that. So they probably would have gone into Chiyu faster or Zygarde. So... Yeah, uh, GG to Fierce Flame. Hopefully we'll bounce back next week. Unfortunately, room service disappeared and couldn't pull it off. I, if I brought rocks. Yo, if I brought rocks on Uxie, I think I had it, actually. That's crazy. Okay, yeah. Um, anyways, GG. Uh, thank you all so much for watching. Yeah, we'll be back next week. Bash out.